Hi hi you guys welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel so guys i reached 10 subscribers on my channel and thank you so much you guys for giving me a chance it really means a lot to me so guys today's video is going to be a haul video and it is going to be a very good mix of makeup and skin care so let's jump right into the video So let's start with skincare first. So the brand Plum Goodness has been launching so many serums in the last few months and I was really intrigued you guys and I also like the niacinamide serum so much which I have already reviewed you guys. So I'll link that video right in the i button and also in the description box. So I bought these three serums and I'll go through each one by one. So the first serum is this Plum Goodness Bulgarian Rose and Hyaluronic Acid Serum. and it has 2% hyaluronic acid in it so this serum comes in two sizes 15 ml and 30 ml and 15 ml costs 450 rupees and 30 ml costs 790 rupees i've got the 15 ml one here so here it says that it has a mix of high and low molecular weight hyaluronic acid so having a mix is a good thing you guys because if the serum has only high molecular hyaluronic acid it will not penetrate your skin and thus it will not hydrate your skin and if the serum has only low molecular hyaluronic acid it will go much deeper into your skin and thus it will irritate your skin so the product comes in a carton box like this and the actual product is a glass bottle like this it has a consistency like this it is a very thin consistency you guys looking at the consistency i feel like it is going to be a hydrating serum which is what you expect from a hyaluronic acid serum the next serum i'm going to talk about is from the same brand plum goodness which is bakuchiol and retinol 1% serum this serum also comes in two sizes 20 ml and 30 ml and the 20 ml costs 550 rupees and 30 ml costs 790 rupees so this serum contains bakuchiol you guys which is a very up and coming retinol alternative and it is supposed to be very very effective and much more milder than the retinol so this serum also comes in a cardboard packaging like this and the actual bottle is a glass bottle and it looks like this you guys i'll show you the consistency and this is what the product looks like as you can see it is a very thin consistency product it is sliding off my hand this also has milky texture and it is in um, like it is in creamy yellow color i've used this serum 3 to 4 times and right off the back i can see that it has a very hydrating consistency So the next serum I'm going to talk about is this latest launch by Plum Goodness and this one is Plum Green Tea and 10% AHA, 5% PHA and 0.5% BHA exfoliating peel and this serum comes in 30 ml and it costs 620 rupees. This serum is supposed to be used on weekly basis and not on daily basis because this serum has such high content of chemical exfoliators in it. and this serum also comes in a cardboard packaging like this and the actual bottle looks like this so this is a 30 ml size and like other serums it does not come in two sizes it only comes in 30 ml size so this is what the serum looks like you guys This serum also has a very thin consistency you guys. So this serum has to be left on your skin like a mask for 10 minutes and then it has to be rinsed off. So I've not used this serum as of now but I will definitely update you guys on this. Moving on to the next product you guys. This is uh, Cosrx Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence long name you guys but this is a very popular product among skin influencers i kept seeing this product and i then i really like gave in so this 100 ml bottle retails for 1450 rupees and it comes in a pump packaging like this and this is the consistency you guys as you can see this also is a just like essence you guys it also has a very thin consistency but you see you guys this is the consistency this is like a little bit goopy you know 
so this product has a really high content of snail in it and snail is supposed to have very high wound healing properties in it and uh, that's why i really wanted to buy it for myself because i really suffer from acne and i think it will help me in, with my acne a lot so now let's start with the makeup products so i bought these four k beauty products because i wanted to uh, do a one brand makeup look with k beauty because i'm really interested in the brand so i'll go through these one by one so the first product i have here is this k beauty illuminating highlighter and this product you guys comes packaged like really really nicely like can you see there is foam inside all around the product this is what the actual product looks like this looks exactly like the blush packaging and which is amazing you guys because i just love 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 k beauty k packaging you guys <laughs> so the actual highlighter looks like this and i have it this in the shade sunlit gold my god this is so good this swatched really really nicely you guys see the highlighting effect this is giving me well i'll have to use this on the face and then like then only then i can let you know but uh but first impressions is really good so the next k beauty product i have here is this matte drama lipstick and this is in the shade snapshot so this lipstick costed me a lot like 999 rupees which is very pricey you guys but can you look at the packaging you guys this has such a good packaging it also has magnetic closure with it and the packaging looks really really sturdy it costs a lot but the packaging they have given is a very high quality packaging so this is what the actual lipstick looks like this is the bullet shaped like i've not seen a bullet shape like this and this is what the lipstick shade looks like this is a very brownie mauvey kind of a shade um, i i don't have anything like this in my collection i do believe that it will look very good with the heavy eye makeup look so the next product i have here is this k beauty metal show eye shadow stick and it is in the shade jaded glow so the actual eye shadow stick looks like this and wow i really I'm really excited about this color you guys. Oh my god, look at the color. Oh my god, you guys. I'm really excited about this color. And it is very creamy also. So this eyeshadow costs 599 rupees. So the next product I have here is this May Strobe lip topper in the shade Cover Girl. and i got this as complimentary when i was buying uh, so many k beauty products and this is what the packaging looks like so this is a lip topper you guys and it has a wand like this and this is what the shade looks like and it costs 699 rupees i'm not into glittery lipsticks you guys but i got this as complimentary so I might try this. The next product I have here is this Elf Cosmetics Bite Size Eyeshadow Palette and this one is in the shade Carnival Candy. This costed me 350 rupees and it has four shades like this like it has three neutral shades and this amazing beautiful blue shade i'm really excited to use this shade you guys elf cosmetics has this kind of bite size palettes in like 6 or 7 shades so i was like if i like this palette i will buy another shades in this so these are the swatches you guys i'm really interested in this blue color and i'm also liking this these two color you know i'm i'm not sure about this color because i don't know how i'm going to use this the, this one but these three colors i'm really really liking So the next products are these two lipstick by Fran Wilson. I was like I really kept seeing this on Nykaa app and uh, one day I just gave in and bought the product. So these costed me 590 rupees each and this is what the actual packaging looks like and this one is a black shade and this is not black shade you guys and this one is white and this is also not white shade. These are supposed to turn into your personalized pink lipsticks you guys so i'll swatch this as you can see it is turning pink this is the 
black shade this is the white lipstick shade you guys and this is the black lipstick shade this black lipstick shade has turned into more deeper pink and then the white lipstick so you might be thinking that these are two gimmicky products i don't know i really like the concept of uh, black and white lipsticks turning into pink lipsticks so so the next product i have here is this maybelline fit me foundation which is in the shade 310 sun beige and this is a repurchase for me you guys earlier this foundation used to come in one size it only and that was in a glass bottle and few years ago i used to like that a lot and I actually finished the bottle. So I really wanted to buy a mini foundation for my makeup bag for office and I saw this on the Nykaa app and it was really affordable like it costed me like 299 rupees. It says on the um, tube but uh, I bought it on discount for 200 something rupees but uh, I remembered that I really liked the foundation and, and I just bought it for my makeup bag. So I've got another Maybelline product here and this one is the Maybelline Sensational Liquid Matte Lipstick in the shade 08 in the shade Sensationally Me. Okay, so this product has got a very thin wand to it and this is what the shade looks like. It is kind of a pinky nude lipstick but it has more pink in it. I don't know what came to me. I bought the same product twice. <laughs> and uh, I've opened this I'm, and I've not opened this at all this is completely packaged in plastic so I'm thinking you guys to, of doing a mini giveaway um, for my YouTube channel which is going to be a very first one so let me know you guys if any one of you wants this lipstick I'll send it to you guys just comment down on the video that you want this product and also subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll send it to you guys so in that way it is going to be a good mistake <laughs> so that was it for the video you guys i really hope you liked the video and if you did please like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos like this bye guys